we got one more story to talk about. And this, this one here is concerning, man. This is concerning. Jamie Foxx, when it comes to talent in Hollywood, it probably does not get more talented than Jamie Foxx. The man is a tremendous musician. He's a great actor. He can do it all in Hollywood. Not too many guys like him. And he's a comedian. I mean, Jamie Foxx, to me, started out on, on In Living Color as a comedian. I mean, he was he was tremendous yeah. in Ray playing Ray Charles. Um, I would be an absolute irresponsible idiot if I did not recognize his work as Tubbs in the highly underrated Miami oh, Vice. That movie. Miami Vice movie is so underrated, man. We did I a watch party on on that movie. Remember, you and I, I love, I love that, that movie, movie so much. We did a watch party, yeah. Yep. And I know how much you love Django Unchained. Oh my God! It's a great. That's a really good movie. It's, That's a really it's good a movie. great flick. Yeah. yeah, but Jamie Foxx has been hospitalized for almost a month, and every time I open up my computer, I will see like little articles here. Uh, pray for Jamie Foxx. Uh, something happened to Jamie Foxx. His daughter came out and said, "Yeah, Jamie Foxx hospitalized. Something happened to him." We don't exactly know what happened to him. Now. I think like about three days, four days after we found out he was hospitalized, there's an article came down and said he had a stroke and never heard about that again. So I really don't even know if it was even a stroke. It sounds bad. It sounds bad. It but sounds it, bad. We, we keep hearing that, oh, he's getting better. He's getting better. But that was like a week after he got hospitalized. And we haven't heard from Jamie Foxx himself until now so jamie fox has finally broken his silence on his hospitalization but we still don't know what it is so right here jamie fox issues first statement amid hospitalization what we know about his medical complication and i'm gonna be real you don't know anything you don't but this is what he put out on, uh, I believe this Instagram here it says, appreciate all the love, feeling blessed. Now, I'm glad that he actually put out something. So at least we know that. Um, I guess he's doing OK. How do we know I this was know. him that even put it out, put it out? I'm going to say it, it was probably him because it came directly from his official account. That's that's the only thing I could say, because before that, we didn't get anything. Um, from Jamie Foxx at all. Nothing. I know he's not coming back to his show right now either. Okay, this this the timeline here. April 11th, um, he gets hospitalized due to an undisclosed medical condition. And they said before that, he was at, actually looking healthy. The next day, news actually breaks about um, him being hospitalized. His daughter um, says um, he experienced a medical condition and he is on his way to recovery. That was on the 12th, so three weeks ago. Next day, TMZ cites the source saying Fox is doing a lot better. Then on the 17th, remains hospitalized and undergoing medical tests. Uh, the 18th, production on Back in Action resumes with body doubles. Standing in for him. Martin Lawrence, April 20th. Says that his friend's doing better. Same old thing. April 21st. Fox is improving. And working on his recovery. 23rd. Nick Cannon says the actor is awake. I know he's doing much better. We keep hearing the same thing. Yeah, over Yeah, that's a little interesting. And then May 3rd. Fox remains uh, hospitalized and prayers keep going out. I don't know what to make it is. I'm going to say a name to you here in all this. And I just want to, I want to gauge your reaction. Doesn't this okay. have a very Damar Hamlin feel to it? Think about it. Kinda. Think about it. And, and everybody's being sort of vague. Could it have been? And, and 
I know, believe if it was like cardiac arrest, I believe we would have found out about that. Well, some people are saying a stroke. Yeah, people are saying a stroke. You know? I mean, that we don't know for really sure, fast. but it, it's how come we haven't gotten anything more specific about this? And not only that, when you start looking through that timeline, dude, we're talking about nearly three weeks now. Yeah. And he's still in the hospital. Do you think he suffered a major stroke? Like maybe this was a major stroke. It's possible. It's possible. But we don't you even know. know. Only thing we got was he's alert. I mean, even if it was like a mini stroke, you don't stay in a hospital that long. Oh, I mean, no. Oh, my, my, mom, mini my, stroke. My, my, my mom had two uh, mini strokes. Some, some people strong. have mini strokes and never even get hospitalized at all. Yeah. They, just, they just do the test. They diagnose it. You know, they they do some things to see if you've got any lasting damage, and then you're you're gone. I mean, you yeah. know, they they'll diagnose that, you know, at a hospital in an ER, and then release you because they can't really do any more. Yeah, and Jamie Foxx usually in shape. He's usually in pretty good shape, so I don't good, know. Good physical condition. He always keeps himself in tip top shape. Um. There's mystery because they keep saying, you're right. They keep using the same words, alert, aware. Well, that's all we're getting. We're not getting any, he's up walking around, you know, he's walking around the halls. He's it's almost the same statement for two, two weeks straight. Yeah. And I don't even think a heart attack wouldn't keep you in the hospital that long. You wouldn't be in the hospital that long. I mean, even even a stroke wouldn't keep you in the hospital that long, I don't think. I don't know what's going on with him. I don't either. I don't either. It, it, it's, this is sound, there sounds like there's some mystery behind this. Yeah. Yeah. We Look, we wish him a, a quick recovery. Oh, That's yeah, like, definitely. Definitely. You know, uh, yeah. I mean, Black and White Network supporters, make sure you check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. Make sure you use promo code USA First, all one word. USA First, all one word will get you 25% off. Go get them right now.